Welcome back everyone, I am the Depressed Dior, and this is our Darker Purpose. Let's continue. So yeah, where I last left off, we're trying to um, trigger our merit. We need to kill one more thing without rolling. And I've taken a lot of damage. Ouch. Yeah, these things are so annoying. They have very long reach. There we go. Now we have 20% resist. So now we can roll again. It would be nice if it would actually tell you if you got the merit or not. Oh, it did. Oh, it does. It keeps count. Neat. It used to not. Maybe it got patched. I don't know how well that fire stuff is, but it's better than nothing. Awesome, we level up instantly next floor. And a vending machine, which we don't have enough money for. I definitely need to buy juice boxes with my allowance when I get the chance. But chances are we're gonna die before that. Fire things rather interesting. And I leveled. Juice boxes of darkness. Plus five damage. Juice boxes of permanently increased damage by two. Amazing. Ah, uh, but rapid shot. Anyway, um juice boxes of darkness. Ah, uh, it continues to clamor for sugar water. Tender is the rapid shot. Well now you're just getting desperate. You know what? I am desperate. So we'll go ahead and take that. I mean, I could have increased my damage by like 9 already by using healing and stuff, but attack speed's always good. Especially when you attack really, really fast. Yeah, it's gotten pretty fast now. And we have enough to buy a juice box. Yay. Which also means more proc chances for the uh, other stuff. box. Amazing. Okay. So we have enough to buy ourselves a juice box, or we can increase the worth, make our juice boxes heal more. That's our choices. Let's make them heal more. Now, let me look at my perks real quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At 20% life. So 20% of essentially 150 is 30 HP. Yeah. So if I'm at 30, I can do extra damage. That's a little too low for my taste. Because it's because you, the boss hits really, really hard. It's the issue. But who knows? We'll see how it goes. All right, here goes nothing. What happens if I do this? I'm already taking ridiculous amounts of hits. God, he has 
really hit big hitbox. Does it make sense because he's a very big guy? So yeah, I kind of tap it. That way I'm constantly stopping to do the double shot. Ouch. Okay. Well, I am now down to... Let's not die, shall we? God, I hate this requirement. But it could be worse. There could be acid. Oh, I gotta be careful. I don't want to accidentally break a building. So yeah, he's, she's now gotten bigger, much bigger, and I am taking lots of hits. <sighs> Great, thank you. Thank you for making those freaking bolts go different directions. Alright. And I'm dead already. Oh well, we did unlock a bunch of new stuff, which is nice. So let's go to upgrades. What did we unlock? Oh, we found a lot of new items, that's what we did. Alright, a little something for you, donate, blah blah blah, extra class period. So now we have an extra class period. Huh? Oh, gotcha. It's been upgraded. So now it's at 100 credits and in the... In the we have, we have to do it 100 credits at a time now, instead of 25. Now the good news is we have um, an additional credit, so we're going to go ahead and get ourselves hide and seek as well. So now we got additional roll speed on top of the extra crit chance, which didn't really help us m much to begin with. Part of me wants to actually just go ahead and get shyness instead and go for the extra range. Yeah, we'll go with that. Plus 50% range is good. Alright. Start again. Yeah, definitely like that. Alright. Oh, great. Now, what a way to start. Already taking hits. Room of death. There's the boss already. Another one of these rooms. Perfect, we can shoot bubbles now. give us more. So yeah, they're just slow moving projectiles, but what you can do is just set a wall of them up and just have people run into them for extra damage. You also go through most uh, barriers. Oh wow, barely avoided that. Yeah, I kind of like this extra range. It's very useful. Ah, projectile slowing field. So, projectile slowing field, uh, potato battery. How impressive, no students received dinner tonight on account of 
Mara's little experiment. Alright, onwards. Ouch. Wow, I don't know how I avoided that. Yeah, I definitely love the extra range. It's, I think it's better now. I don't know why I wasn't doing it before. Alright, where the chalk cloud ends. Plus 5% move speed, double the likelihood of, of a memory room per floor. Huh. You do look better in chalk clouds, meaning that you're harder to see. And then the things the monsters carry, and this one is the thing we... Oh. Plus 5 damage, enemies are twice as likely to drop chalk, juice boxes, and tokens. One thing drops some garbage, another picks up some garbage. Boring. Uh... This is per floor, this one's per monster. I'm gonna go ahead and go for the thing the the things the monsters carry. Even though usually it doesn't help me. Oh hey. Uh Fedora of Crisis reduces all damage by twenty five percent when under twenty five life uh, percent life. Uh hat privileges are restricted in all but the most exceptional circumstances. Good to know. Ah, uh, kill them all. Ah. 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 Okay, Doki. I think the memory room is that room, that, that secret room we went into. That unfortunately had an enemy in it. Instead of the good stuff that I've been trying to explain to you guys. Alright, let's do this. Ah, uh, let's see. Chalk lady. Not a big deal. Now the convenient part is I can actually almost hit the, uh, hit her from anywhere in the room, next to this extra speed, or extra range rather. Oh my god, this slow thing is actually pretty useful. It, it's not as useful against like swarms. But it definitely works with these big slow moving, uh, big, big projectiles rather. You can actually hit um, the boss while she's going around the chalkboards, but it's a little bit hard to uh, notice. There we go. Oh, that was easy. Alright, well, what I'm going to go ahead and do, against my better judgment, is to run up here. We are going to attempt to get that juice box. Got it. And see if we can start the next stage with uh, max health. Okay. Adequate? Barely adequate, really. Well, screw you two. Alright then. Too small, leaderless. Alright, we're going for too small then. Gotta be careful with the bubbles though, because they kind of weave around and you might hit these like electric explosive thingy majiggies. That is a scientific term. Wow, almost rolled right into that. Alright, lots of juice boxes. Awesome. Go, 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 go. All the these sets up, setups are pretty much the same, so I already know them all. Shoots ricochet. Escher's compass. Calculates angles. Useful for scaffolding repairs, repair, and boiler maintenance detention groups. Awesome. So yeah, bounce off. Not really that useful, because these rooms are generally more open than in uh, Binding of Isaac. But, it's still an item. Hey, 
Yeah, thank you, slow moving projectiles. Alright, we need to deal with something. One thing at a time. Ouch. He's doing so well. Kind of hard to keep track of my range because when I'm when I'm moving, my range is just awful. Thank you, bubbles. So yeah, the bubbles are just getting over there. Awesome. Alright, a good coin is hard to find. Enemies twice as likely to drop tokens. Um, plus 15 life as well. There are more loose change in house incinerators if you're so inclined. Clockwork. Okay, we've already seen that one. Let's go for more tokens. Why not? Let's go for that weird build. Oh, and we also get ourselves... Stuff in the locker. Collect 35 uh, items over multiple playthroughs. 50 credits. Alright, max crit. Destroyed after taking 90 damage. So we now have a lot more damage. Hey, it's you. Right now I don't have enough money to buy any of this. I can buy a juice box, but I don't need one. Alright. That's you again. I don't have to worry about the, um, um, achievement for this one. Yay for bubble crits. Yeah, these blobs don't have any hit points, so even the bubbles can kill them. It's rather convenient. Let's go ahead and head back up real quick. Grab that, grab that, and let's get going. Hey, we also got an additional report card bonus of 8. So yeah, you get, I guess, an additional 200% uh, credits for good an A, an A grade. I mean, I only got hit once, so not bad. Alright. Underlit. For some reason, light doesn't travel very far on this floor. At least none of you will have to look at each other. Damn. Alright, we'll go for the one that's lit. <laughs> and we'll see how things go from there. Wish I could shoot while rolling. But I haven't unlocked that achievement yet. juice boxes. Yep. Okay. 
not do any slowing, unfortunately. But I can shoot real far. Gotcha. Another chalk drawing, but this one's different. Alright. Sad chalking of chalk. Plus one chalk, 20% chance of not consuming chalk on use. I'm really not used to using chalk, unfortunately. I'm not really good at it. Because it's an awkward bomb type weapon. Such depth and creativity. We assume the artist was a chalk drawing. What was it chalk drawing as well? Ah. Ouch, did it hit there? That's bad. Remember, 90 damage and my crits are gone. Curve me right into it. Level up instantly next floor. Awesome. Shit, I'm taking lots of damage. Might go straight for the boss just so I can take care of that one faster. Expectation, great expectations of juice boxes, blah blah blah. Type it fake and generally loathe them, just like the juice we, we serve them. Call of the Well Furniture, plus 10% attack speed, deal 20% more damage against bosses. A better child would treat their home with more respect. Alright, we're dealing more damage to bosses. That and crits, can't complain. Okay, three, two, one. Can't wait! The dark fire will not avail you. Wow. When you say it, say it, uh, wow. <laughs> they talk way too fast. Oh well. Oh, it's you. Well, it's not special. Thank you, slow projectiles. Yeah, that was a lot of bubbles. Takes care of you. Alright. What do you have? Snock snake. Uh, it's not snake. We are definitely taking sock snake. Thank you. Now I can shoot long range or chain. Um, projectiles that crit and do extra damage to bosses. Almost rocked right into attack there. Next. Alright, we have like one room left, so we'll go ahead and take care of that. Then get ourselves a juice box. Oh, screw that. So yeah, when I'm not moving, I shoot extra projectiles. Choose. So, what are our chances of actually succeeding this time against the boss while doing the achievement at the exact same time? You're thinking 3%. You're being way too generous to me. Alright. Should get ourselves a. L oh, thank you. I should have paying attention there. Yay, a D. But I level instantly. Thank you. Um, I have no cooldowns right now, I don't think. Zen in the art of pummeling. You're not very good at dodging, are you? This issue is not really my health, but the fact that I don't have enough good healing items, so really the extra health is just delaying the inevitable. Anyway, we assure you that health security measures are quite subtle and humane. Alright, we'll take it this one. The extra attack speed. You can see our attack speed here. Our attack rate is nearly two shots a second. Okay, this place has a memory. Which is nice. And apparently there's someone throwing furniture at me. There you are. At least I killed it. Or 
her rather. else in this room? No. And there's a ghost around here, so let's go ahead and deal with that madness. Yep, going that way. Oh, great. I ran right into the cloud. There we go. I gotta wait until my controls fix themselves. Alright, slow shot would be nice. Oh god, there's more of them. Also, I went the wrong way. Okay. Could have been worse. Alright, let's go find that ghost guy so I can at least get some more achievements unlocked. Or, or uh,. Yeah, pretty much achievements unlocked. Alright, this time I actually picked the right direction. Yeah, it just took a lot of damage. So my crit's probably gone by now. Yep, it is. But that's because there's freaking a million of these things. thing is gone, not surprised. That was really awful, because there was like a bazillion of those of those chalk guys and people tossing chairs at me. But now I have a Bunsen burner. Alright. Which way? You're going down? Right. Hopefully you're not a boss this time. Yeah, I can't rely on my damage anymore. Furious the, the case of the Furious Chandelier. I have always had a taste for reclaimed things, the fashion designer said. The platinum crescent was originally considered vulgar. Borgoist trash, or Borgoist trash, whatever. Today it is known as the most beautiful sewing machine in the world. I keep it in my workshop. I'm here all day, every day, and I can't imagine it'd be safer anywhere else. She paused. Excuse me, am I boring you? Shuddering, Jim rubbed his eyes. No, he, he said, he said, uh, he said. Just tired. Bad dreams keeping me up. The designer wagged her finger. Your dreams can be warnings. Be respectful. She gestured to the dresses on the mannequins that surround them in the shop. They can also be, uh, be beautiful. My dreams grace the run, uh, runways of every fall and spring show worth mentioning. Behind them, one of the bandits' henchmen adjusted his mask. Not all of the mannequins were mannequins. Book 9 in the Shuddering Gym series, page 71, Edgeworth Library, number blah 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 blah. So yeah. So you get some lore, and if you look down there, you get a, you can, you'll see an achievement requirement. Apple Polisher, donate 500 credits to the Guidance Counselor. Not that useful, because I already know you're supposed to donate shit to her. And sometimes you just get coins, which is what I just got. Okay, so I'm hurting pretty bad. Not ri I don't think I'm going to be able to do this boss fight. I'm also going to go a little over time for this one. Okay, one down. Thank you, Ricochet Shots. Ricochet Shot is actually kind of useful when you actually have, sh uh, you know, a range to your shots. Okay, that's all we have here. Let's check what's down here. Boss there. Okay, done there. Done there. Yeah, get away from me. There we go. I 
wish that fire thing would trigger more often, because it's actually kind of useful for taking out multiple mobs. I hope there's a shop. There it is. Uh, Garborvin's sense of fear, 9% dodge. He had the oddly present uh, presence concern that he would one day be distilled. Lobster of foreboding, plus 20% resist. Uh, yes, a terrible omen, but thankfully only for the students who sees it. Our condolences to William D. All right, that's uh, that's all we have here, and I don't have much to work with. So I will go ahead and get a juice box and pray. That's really all I can do. Let's get some health. I have one juice box to spare. That's about it. One chalk. But I do two point twenty plus twenty percent damage against bosses. That's something. All right, let's do this again. Now, the thing about slowing project, uh, projectiles in a barrier, um, it can wall you in if you're not careful. I know this from playing uh, certain bullet games where you actually had that ability. So yeah, the, the uh, electric barrier goes full circle one direction and then alter. Which is kind of annoying. Okay, here's my last juice box. Oh, thank you for ambushing me. Clouds are freaking in the way. Yeah, I just took a hit. Yeah, I'm pretty much dead. There's just way too much junk in the way. Pretty much you have to win this through crits, and I don't have any crits. Oh, I almost pulled it off. Upgrades. Oh. Next time I donate, I might get something out of it. I know at 500 I get something. Alright. At least we're finding a lot of items. So, that's it for right now. I am Theta Prestior, and this was Our Darker Purpose. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys later.